by the name of Johnny. Johnny is an everybody man. He slaps his kind of funny. Yeah. Funny for Kia, that is. Johnny cares about war. Johnny cares about cancer. Johnny wonders if there's any hope. Wonders if there is an answer. Yeah. Thinks about life and what's more. Is there a God? He's not sure. Takes a look at hope, thinks it's just another pipe dream, but someone cares enough to help. It's just another hope type dream. Yeah. Nothing against them, nothing. Not me, I mean, not personally, I mean. But I mean, say, I wouldn't go running off to their country, would I? And expect, I mean, Africa, India, wherever it is, and expect them to open the doors for me now, would I, eh? Eh? That's the reason, doesn't it? Of course I wouldn't. What's up? Hey, you're with me, remember? Hmm? Oh, nothing. What's up, Johnny? Look, look, you and me, all of us here, Born in this country, right? Right. Grew up, fought for it. Work, we worked hard for what we got, didn't we, eh? But you get these knick-knocks coming over here, mate. The first thing they ask for, the nationalists. Oh. I've right. seen them, I've heard them. Straight off the old banana book. Excuse me, please, Messer, where's the nearest net? Yeah? You, you can laugh, mate, but I'm telling you, next thing, what do you see, eh? Big, flashy cars, washing machines, fridges. Oh. They don't give nothing away, mind you. It's all take, take, take. And what do you get, eh? There they are, driving around. They run you down as soon as they look at you. I mean it, you know. I don't blame them. Don't blame who? The coloured blokes. If that's the kind of stupid twit they're up against. Worked? I bet he hasn't done a day's work in his life except for raising a pint. I wish they would run him over. You seem more concerned with him than you do with me. <laughs> look, uh, have another drink before closing. Uh, one for the road, Joe? No, thanks, and my name's Carol. <laughs> Sorry. I'm uh, rotten on names, you know. Do you live round here, then? Not far. What you do? Loads of things. Want to try me? No, I mean, what job do you do? My old man runs a shop. And you work in it? Yeah. You don't sound very thrilled about it. Nah, it's OK. <laughs> do you come here often, then? Oh, that's what they all say. Only in the mating season. Well, you did ask me to talk to you instead of listening to that old git over there. I can't think of anything else to say. He's really upset, hasn't he? No, not exactly. He just bugs me a bit, that's all. Well, then why don't you say something to him? No, not me. Johnny the Caution, they call me, you know. He's all right. He's just a bit tight, that's all. He believes every single lousy word he says. That's a trouble. It's the one of the blacks don't like us with types like that around. Oh, you do go on, don't you? Look, are you sure you won't have one for the roof? Not for me, thanks. Okay, come on, I'll walk you home. Oh, oh this curry they cook, smelling the place out something there. It's bloody disgraceful. On, I mean, on a Sunday, and on a Sunday, mind you. Oi, got the time? Yeah, it's it. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hey, where'd you live? Stand Lake. Hey, but that's ten miles away. Oh, but there's a bus. Well, what time's the last one? At eleven. Oh, well, come on. Ah, oh, well, there she goes. Oh, look. Now the strap's just gone on my rotten shoe. Sorry, love. I clean forgot about the time. Oh, my dad'll murder me. Hey, can we get a taxi? Yeah, well, five bob won't get us very far, will it? Well, I can't walk. Not with this. Hey, what about the trains? Oh, they stopped running through Stanley years ago. 
And your dad gets steamed up if you stop that late, does he? You ought to see him. No, thanks. I'll take your word for it. Well, look, you don't have to stop with me. I mean, you're all right living round here. What do you think I am? I mean, do you think I'm the kind of bloke to leave you standing here on your tod? Oh, look, there must be something. I mean, there has to be. It doesn't. Just think. Are you thinking? Yeah. I'm thinking it's not as if you were in love with me. Well, how do you know I'm not? I once told me if you run out of cash and you can't get home, the local vicar will lend it to you. The vicar? Uh, out of the poor fund, yeah. Oh, he was having you on. Do you want to walk, then? No. Oh, well, look, the least we can do is try. There's a church just down this road. Well, come on, then. My friends, I wish I could help you. I really do. And, of course, we do help those in need from time to time in practical ways. But, well, I'm very much afraid. Look, I'll get it back to you tomorrow. I swear it. I know you would, my boy. I don't doubt you for a second. But you see, we have a little rule here about handing over cash. The church council, you know. And you really should have watched the time. Yeah, well, we didn't, and that's that. I'm very much afraid that it is. Yes. What? That. Uh, may I suggest that you try the police station down the road? They may be able to think of something. Oh, look, I just need... I'm terribly sorry. If I could, I would. I'm quite sure that you understand. Good night. Good night. Let's go. Lend you what? Oh, well, just until tomorrow. Oh, you've got a bit of a nerve, haven't you, mate? No, I don't think so. Well, what would I do if everyone come in here asking me to borrow their taxi fare home? Yeah, well, they didn't, did they? Just the two of us. Look, it's not from me, it's for her. Oh, come on, Sarge, have a heart. Don't call me Sarge and don't ask me for a heart. I'll tell you what I can do, if you like. Got a couple of cells in the back there. You can have them for the night. <laughs> ah, very funny. Right. Go on, thumb a lift or walk it, but hop it out of here now. Go on. Thank you. Young and 
so much younger than today. I never needed anybody's help in any way. But now these days are gone, I'm not so self-assured. And now I find I've changed my mind, I've opened up the door. Help me if you can, I'm feeling down. And I do appreciate your being right. Get my feet back on the ground Won't you please help me When I was young and so much younger than today I never needed anybody's help in any way But now these days are gone I'm not so self-assured And now I find I've changed my mind I've opened up the door Help me if you can I'm feeling down And I do appreciate your being round Help me get my feet back on the ground Won't you please, please help me Please, please help me Please, please help me. Would you help me, please? Please help me. Come on and help me. Please help me. Help me. Please help me. Won't you please, please help me? Help me, please. Please, please help me. Won't you please help me? Please, please help me. Won't you please help me? Please, please help me. Help me, help me. I'm in need of help. Please, please help me. I'm in need of your help. Nobody bothers about anybody else these days. Yeah, no one's going to kill themselves to give us a lift this time of night, are they? Still, it's not surprising when you get blokes like that one in a pub tonight. Oh, he really knocked you, didn't he? Well, didn't he, you? I don't know. I didn't listen. Not really. I mean, why is it people tell lies just to make a point? I mean, making out that the blacks live off the state just to get rich. <laughs> yeah, the truth is they do all the dirty jobs. The kind of jobs that bloke would run a mile from, and that's all the thanks they get, too. Well, then why do people like him go on all the time about him? Why do they get so worked up? I don't know. Gives them a kick, I suppose. Gives them an excuse to stand up in some pub and shout his rotten mouth off. Blame others for all their... Laziness. Yeah. Charity begins at home, and that is where they're going to keep it. It's a funny life we live For years I've tried to sort it out But nothing seems to give Calamity, catastrophe Disasters in the air You and I have blown our minds And no one, nobody Seems to care It's a funny day that's dying It's a funny night ahead Blank faces blink, unseeing eyes And Grandma goes to bed Calamity, catastrophe Disasters in the air seen the light, yet no one, nobody seems to care. It's a funny fear I'm feeling, it's a funny pain inside, like a frightened kid with nightmares on a long and lonely Catastrophe Disasters in the air It worries you It shatters me That no one, nobody Seems to care No one seems to care
glad you're with me. So am I. No, I mean, I only just met you tonight and all that. We could have just cleared off. I could have, I suppose, yeah. So you do care, a bit. Some people care. <laughs> yeah. Never the ones with the loot to get you home, though. Oh, I don't mind, Johnny. Well, you will when your dad gets going. He's all right. He just worries a bit, that's all. So, you see, he cares as well. Yeah, I suppose he does. Hey, we could ring him and let him know you're all right in that. Yeah, we could. Oh, where's the phone box? Well, there's only one thing. What's that? We're not on the phone. Oh, great. <laughs> hey, don't look too bothered about it, do you? Oh, well, he won't get us very far, will he? No, yeah, I suppose not. What do you want to do, Johnny? I want to see a bus come down this road now. No, I mean, don't you ever want to get married and settle down? I don't know. I haven't really given it much thought, I suppose so. I mean, everyone does, don't they? I've always dreamed of getting married and living in a nice big house. What's the matter with a nice little house? I don't know. I've always dreamed of a nice big house somehow. <laughs> yeah, I guess girls do. Just to leave home and have a place of your own. It must be great. To be able to come and go whenever you please and, and not have to worry if you miss the last bus. <laughs> yeah. It'd be great, wouldn't it? Hey, this isn't a proposal or something, is it? No! Oh, no, I didn't mean to. <laughs> sure. Hey, well, you wouldn't want to marry me, Barbara, would you? Carol. There, you see, I've got no powers of concentration. You said that on purpose, didn't you? Maybe. You made your point. Anyway, at this very moment, there are much more important things to think about. Like what? Like how to get you home. Uh, excuse me. You're not stuck, are you? I mean, do you want a lift? Do we want a lift? Where are you going to? Stand Lake. Oh. Uh, that's a long way. Uh, yeah, but we've missed the last bus, you see. Oh, I see. Okay, then. I'll get the car. Thanks. Thanks very much. There's a road which leads from Jerusalem The way down to Jericho It's compassion road, steep and tiring road There's danger from thieving foe And on this road is one man Beaten up and left half dead Like many in this world around us Oppressed in despair or unfair on compassion road. Hear him cry out as he lies on compassion road. A priest and Levite walk down the road, giving the man small heed. They are too caught up with religious thoughts to help a man in need. Samaritan walk behind them You are just not in their class But you are the one that helps him You could not see need and just pass You heard a cry As you walked on compassion Oh, oh. 